boys 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 oh my camera is off let's change that real quick boom Ooh. all right let's check out this daily crate almost at a thousand um i've already done the advanced and daily challenge oh i feel like people get mad Yo, what's up, Kanto? Tell you what, if you want, you can join me for a co-op game, but only if you want. Figure we'll open it up with the co-op daily challenge. Get a free Insta monkey that we'll never use. Get 130 monkey money. Yo, what's up, Zilla? Long time. How's it been? Why? Do I have 64 unread text messages? What in the world happened? We're not reading that. We're, we're just gonna put the phone on do not disturb. Remember what happened last time? I do, I do. Yo, what's up, disgusted? Frank? Zilla, you've been doing pretty good. That's what we like to hear. Oh, well, if anyone wants to join, we're doing the daily challenge. Don't tell anyone we're doing co-op. Don't freak out. Look, an app bought me muscle milk. Oh, I forgot my camera doesn't have autofocus. Yeah, 64 unread text messages. I just got back from the gym. So it happened. I was there for like three hours because after we lifted, we played basketball and we went undefeated. Hence why I'm late because I looked at the at my phone. And it was 750. It's like, oh, we have 10 minutes to get home. Oh, Zilla with the hydrate, you got it. So I'm starving. <sighs> and thirsty. All right, let's start this thing up. Hopefully this time it goes a little better. Oh, it's a pop lips. Who wants my money? I don't want it. All right, toaster, you have double money on, which means I probably should have given it to someone else, but that's okay. Unless you can also, oh, he can get the NFT. Let's go. Put this in fast forward. Oh, Frank. That's on me. Does HBot know about the late rounds? No, sir. I do not. Let's look at the rules. Looks pretty normal. Doesn't say custom rounds. We'll be fine. I think it's just a pop lips. GD Colo, dude, you are first. Welcome in. What's up, big batch? Oh. <sighs> Do we have late rounds in here? I didn't think so. Yeah, we have toaster sticks and disgusted. Welcome in, Tibbers. Destroyer or Sun Avatar? Oh, I'm a. Oh, normally I'd be a destroyer, uh, but we don't have access to that. So probably a Sun Avatar. How am I doing? I'm doing pretty well. Thank you for asking. Thank you for asking. Yeah, dude. Sunken Columns was hard, but Scrapyard, I'm convinced we just got a bad roll. Cause I stomped it the next time. And then we beat X Factor a pop up super easily. Maybe I just got used to it again. Look, Nat also made me a salad with uh, with Caesar dressing on it. Cause I just got back from the gym and I haven't eaten yet. <laughs> I got Caesar in my beard. Oh, I got a green onion on my con- Oh, that's bad. I got Caesar on my keyboard. What time is it at my place right now? It's 8.23 p.m. Bang. Put you on strong. All right, Mordecai, do me proud. Dude, what's up, Mozan? Muzan? How are you doing? A triple glue rat carry? 100%. Glue rat OP. 
I don't know where the third glue red is though. I only see two of them. Feels bad. Oh, was there an ad time? Oh no, it's just a hydrate. What's up, ghost? It's 9.23? Dang. We got an East Coast boy. Heck yeah. You don't have it? Feels bad, man. That's okay. It's a great purchase. I highly recommend it. What in the world is that? What in the world is that? I've only bought a few. I bought this one on accident. But we'll take it. Oh, is it a pacifist challenge? Is that why we got that? Heck yeah. Black border to doors temple. Let's go. Jim's was painfully easy. Dude, you probably used like a probably used like an H bomb uh, guide if it was so easy. The animation scared me, dude. It scared me too. I was taken aback. Also, now this is gonna sound pretty, pretty uh, counter productive, but um, uh, my gym was giving out donuts today. I think their goal was to fatten people up so that they were more inclined to work out. It was awesome. I had two long john donuts like that big each. It was glorious. Yo, what's up, milk to beast? I just finished my milk. Oh, should I get Geraldo done? Look at that. You gotta, you gotta spread them out, you know? Spread out the love. X Factor is forgettable and underrated. It's the only advanced map I can, I have on my mind, you know? I assume Disgusted is the one without a hero down. So take my money. This man wanted Chimps X Factor while I can't even beat it on easy. I don't know if we'll even beat it. Last time, what, we got into the... We got into the 40s before we lost, and we lost when I wasn't really paying attention. Maybe it was only the 30s. Who knows? Look at that guy, he's going all the way. The, the green bloom that could. Yo, what's up, Bonsai? 2.24 a.m., dude, big batch. 224. What are you in like uh England or something? Used Degen flagship sky shredder. That is an easy dub, I will admit. That it is. Probably gotta go in half an hour, dude. Fair enough. That's when the stream is supposed to end, but we're probably going till 9 30 today. Dude, do you guys ever I feel like I have something on my lip? Dude, what's up, back down? How you doing? I'm doing pretty well, thanks for asking. I just got back from the gym. I went 3-0 and in basketball. Dude, I'm riding my high horse right now. I shot well for the first time in a long time. What else? That's basically it. Who wants... Oh, I was just about to do that. Okay, fine. I guess I won't. There we go. No tower on water? Yeah. No water towers in this. Uh, this is the uh, daily co-op challenge. Urk, baby. Bonsai's Urkin. Wing monkey. Best flight path. Confirmed. Confirmed. What's the Kahoot today? Dude, it's about the... Oh, I probably shouldn't tell you. I could prepare it, but I don't even have it open. I know what it's on, though. It'll be a good time. All the cool kids will know every answer. You're going to make lunch, so you'll be back in a bit. All right, Frank. Sounds like a plan. How much is this thing worth these days? Seven grand. Holy heck. It's about drive. It's about power. Yes, sir, Tibber. It's about something. Desire. <laughs> That's all I got for you. Once upon a time, I knew some of the words. This is the one thing about co-op. I feel like I just sit here and don't do much. I just talk. Which I guess there's nothing wrong with that. Sitting on a grand. All right, boys. This is how it's done. 
you give your your guy sharpening stone and you're like that and now he's a beast Can you do more co-op games no we have uh we have chimps to beat so every once in a while we will uh we'll open with a co-op uh daily challenge because i have to get the ethan reed what is it like 365 daily challenges so we're gonna have to do them you know that's why i've been doing the advanced and daily challenge it's still gonna take forever Six point six K, dude Zilla, I will take all of your channel points. We still talk about you. I only lose Zilla's points. AC and daily, and then also uh the co-op daily. So you can get three. And this will be my third for today. Yo, what's up? What's up, Am? Am Ram? Welcome in. Am I player three? Dude, I'll play like player three. Let's go. All right, boys, carry me. I'm just a humble banana farmer. Oh, a hydrate. <sighs> oh, <laughs> you're disappointed? Guys, look what I found the other day. I found my Rubik's Cube that I haven't touched in like a long, long time. The good old days, dude. Rubik's Cubes were the bomb. The Federal Reserve? Heck yeah. Look at this. Look how much... Uh, we can't look at how much cash I've generated. Is Ely Facepalm best emote? I should get it. I should get it one day. Will you ever go to an event uh that people can actually meet you dude twitchcon 2022 i'll be there no that would be fun i don't know why someone would want to meet me we just play balloons all day and by all day i mean when i need to record a video or when i'm streaming play with isab and facepalm for no reason would he get mad does he not like facepalming don't mind me. I'm just solving a Rubik's cube on the side. That's what I do. I would be surprised at what and how many people would want to see. Do you remember the Rubik's algorithms? Uh, I I have the basic ones memorized. At one point, I wanted to learn the fast ones, and Nat wrote them down and uh, laminated it. But these are like what I would have to learn if I wanted to do it super fast and I did not memorize them. It was when I broke my wrist and I had nothing but time um, that I was like, oh, I'll learn. And then I saw how much I had to memorize and it looked horrible. Oh, you know, nothing but I say, oh, me neither. Don't you worry. Seems to be chill that he's going to face palm with you. He probably would, to be honest. He is super chill from the sounds of it. People going to Elden Ring on TwitchCon. Josh Intense Monkey Game. Oh, who disconnected? What the heck? I have a Rubik's Cube to solve. Never mind. We can just go to home. Guess no one wanted to play with me. It's whatever. What's your average time? Mine is 60 seconds. I haven't solved one of these in years. I used to be able to do it in under a minute. Now there's no way I can. I don't even, I assume I have them all memorized, but I'll probably have to think for a little bit. I solved white. Ready? Should I do it on camera? We have to do red. We have to get the red in there. Now we have blue and red. All right, I actually have like a dream lineup so far. And we have orange and green. Wait for it. Now we have to do blue and orange. Boom. Now we have the two bottom rows done. So now all that's left is the top. The top is disgusting. So we have to uh, do a little shenanigans. Boom. Now we have the cross on top. And I'm not going to lie. This is the part that I don't quite remember. But I did it right. 
Uh, I don't know if I remember this part either. Wait for it. Do we have one in the right spot? We do. We're almost to the fun part, boys. Oh, we're in the home stretch. We can solve it in the next 10 seconds. Bang! Solved. Easy peasy. All right, let's turn on monkey knowledge for chimps. That's a must. Fun for us. Oh, very fun. Easy peasy. <laughs> All right, back to the main event. I forgot how we solved this. I think we started like this. The start might be rough again. I completely forgot how to do it. But never mind. Goaded. And now we start with. <sighs> we gave it our all. That's the first time we've ever lost on those. If we pop the green, we're normally money. Monkey knowledge is OP and chimps, dude. It really is. We've never not popped these. I wonder what I did wrong. Oh, it's not like getting any. I mean, there is a snipe, but. Oh, yeah. I wonder what I'm doing wrong. Bizarre. Where did we put it last time? Because this was wrong. Maybe, maybe I'll just put it a little farther up. Top left dart should be as close to the center as possible. Oh. Okay. Next time. Once we fail here. So, like there and this one's good this one's money this one's always money there we go dang dude this is impossible in hindsight i should have watched my vod back in the circle it was in the circle. Oh, as close to the center of the circle. We could also just get another dart monkey, but I like if we beat this one. If we beat this one, then we can get a sniper, but let's just, uh, we can do the two dart start or the three dart start. Why not? Just to speed things along. Don't want to keep the, the show waiting, you know? Just make things nice and easy. It'd be funny if we still leaked. Oh, I would have auto rounds on. Can we even handle this? No. Oh my goodness. Guys, this is impossible. How do they do it? Loon trap or destroyer, dude? Destroyer is where it's at. Let's be honest. So you're telling me this is enough. We've done it before. I know it's enough. But today it's just not working. There we go. Oh, that one's that one's looking good. Oh, oh, maybe not. Maybe not. Tragic, dude. <gasps> we got the snipe. Let's go. We got the snipe. Put it on strong and we're off. We're off to the races. Huge. It sniped it like off the screen. Holy cow. Easy peasy. You guys were worried. That's what we were planning on. Bribe the balloons to let you win. That's what we should do. I forgot. Do we get another sniper? Do we get something else? I forgot the whole strap, boys. I'm gonna be honest. I should have watched the VOD. I can see two, two snipers being the way to go. So that's what we're gonna do. If I was smart, I would not have fast forward on, but that's okay. And now we can probably go for Geraldo. 29 snipers, yes. 
Geraldo can probably carry. Is it Geraldo or Geraldo? I'll never actually know. 10 seems like a doozy, but we should be good. I'll slow it down just in case we need to put one on first. There we go. I'm sleepy because you're watching Johnny Depp's trial. Dude, I watched uh, Ludwig covering it for like 10 minutes and I learned what hearsay means. So that was kind of cool, I guess. Other than that, I don't really know anything about the case. Don't know, don't really care. As long as my boy Johnny wins, you know. Really? Geraldo of Rivia says it's Geraldo. Good to know. Or Gerald. Dude, watching The Witcher on Netflix makes me wish that I played the games. Not gonna lie. It looks awesome. I just never played them. All right, we need nine bucks to get our deadly. Hold on. Sad. To get our deadly ninja. Which obviously goes right there. This map kills your brain. It did for me until we've already beaten it many times on different difficulties. And now I, I've kind of have a hang for it. I know what they're going to do. So tomato, tomato. <laughs> yeah. Ninja Kiwi says Geraldo, but we say NFT. So I guess we kind of do what we want, don't we? All right. Ninja discipline, go. You help out that Darwin. Look at that insane sniper micro. I heard if you hit control tab, it goes backwards. Oh, that's so awkward to hit though. Joshua, Blackboard or another brick or Blenarius Prime? Dude, honestly, another brick's easier. Might as well do another brick. You get more monkey money that way too. And a better Insta monkey for Impoppable and Chimps because it's based off the difficulty of the map. All right, might as well get sharp shurikens, right? Might as well. All right, it's round 18. The one thing we have to be careful of is leads, and that's not for a long time. I assume I'm just gonna go for a double shot. Uh, I don't see why I couldn't go all the way there. Interesting. I lied. I'm going right here. Lower him down a ton. Ninja Kiwi has to make a playground base map. That'd be kind of cool. That would be kind of cool. They go like down a slide or something. That hasn't really... Uh... Other maps have been so well thought out in BTD6. Remember in Battles 5 when it was just like a bunch of planets that they would go around and then in this map it's like an actual war scene or in this game is this music super loud for you guys there we go hmm i don't know how many more rounds we can beat the fact that elite sniper is good on chimps makes me laugh we're gonna be going bouncing bullet snipers don't you worry but yeah that is funny Oh, this guy's still on first. <sighs> we lost to a red with three gold needed for double shot. Three. I almost bought Caltrops too. That's okay. That's why we're here to get this snipe. We live for round six. Confirmed, if you put it in slow-mo, you're more likely to get the snipe. We don't need the snipe, apparently. We're just better. We're just built different. We know where to put it now. Ace could be good. Oh, it definitely could be. And we could have afforded it. We'll probably be going Sky Shredder. 
that's uh my go-to as of late let's see i don't really know what else we would go we're probably gonna go like double bouncing bullet with an alchemist uh geraldo's uh sharpening stone and uh a village that makes them cheaper the double bouncing bullet should carry like the entire mid game with an with a operation dart storm to pop the mobs yeah we'll be good the only thing is i made one of my snipers a one zero zero i guess i could just get two other snipers for zero three twos the sharpening stone all right i feel like we have this under control this map You can use the sharpening stone on bottom path ice. Can you really? That's kind of epic. Do I need to put you on first? Probably. Beautiful. Put you back on strong. And then be free. Pop them all. What streamer you can't place? The sky shredder? This uh won't be as good. The stream won't be as good? No, it'll be better because you guys will have so much stuff to look at. Oh, slow down. We have to get Geraldo down. There we go. You could pair the snipers with a MAME. Yes, that's what the 100 will become. Good call. Good freaking call. Right, we went straight for the ninja last time and we're probably going to do it again. 540 we can get it now i can see it already there we go you've never found a good strat for uh x factor i mean either this is like this is our first real day of trying it on uh especially your first right yeah you just take forever it's our first real day of trying it on chimps we gave it like two goes last time you can try spiffy's sigh and perma spike Perma spike. Uh, you know, maybe if I watch the video, I'll try it. Oh, come on, come on, come on. I didn't even seek it through. I wasn't even worried. I wasn't even worried. I thought it, uh, I didn't even see the balloon. I was waiting to micro the snipers. I guess I'm just, uh, I can't see the sneaky reds. The dart missed it. Classic. Oh, we're using all the pierce today, boys. Look at that. Okay, I don't know what I'm doing different, but we're just better. We're just better. Dubloon uses Shinobi spam plus Pat Fusty. Shinobi spam is insane. The 21 ninja strat is actually bonkers i use that for a lot of maps it's like a free win that's why i didn't off the coast i like didn't want to try too hard on a, a guide i was like when it, back when i made guides i wanted them to work 100 percent of the time and i didn't want to do a worse guide for off the coast just because it was easier and i was like we'll do 21 ninjas we'll make it a free win you're welcome in link I'd suggest going a 302 before affording bouncing. That's the plan. But we were almost there the first time. We just had to get a uh we just had to get caltrops first, apparently. We were three gold short. Either that or get a shooty turret. I assume. Yeah, okay, good. I was like, there's no way I actually have to micro the snipers. Link, how you doing today? 650 let's get this let's get this guy going there we go caltrops are very important maybe we'll make it a uh a 102 we can get sharpening stone on it and even the caltrops will have more pierce it'll be nutty i like that geraldo can just clean up this path the bottom path
put this guy a little lower this time. I don't know if that was the play. Kind of like it so far. Hello, how are you today? Just got my first black border on cubism and you're very happy. Well, well done, man. First black border is a happy day. It's a good day. All right, I'm watching this time. Look at that. Look at that. Now it's easy from here. Guaranteed free win. Look, it'll snipe it. Easy. All right, we're going for Caltrops. Honestly, I should have put the snipers on first for this round so they don't regrow, but that's fine. Your tutorials are great. They help me black border monkey meadows. Dude, let's go. My monkey meadows guide has so many views and I kind of thought it would solely because it's the first map. But yeah, I'm, uh, I'm glad the guide still holds up. Oh, look at these caltrops. Snipers aren't affected by line of sight, but if you want to upgrade further, worth considering. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They just can't pop in the middle. Yep. That's why I just throw them off to the left. So when I do buff them with an elk, they uh, aren't concerned with others trying to steal their elk buff. Get sharper. All right, now that we have Caltrops and sharper, I think we'll be good for a long time. At this point, last time I bought the Full Metal Jacket. But let's be honest, Caltrops are better than Full Metal Jacket. There we go. Now you just have 37 more to go and then I'll acknowledge you. Oh, yes. Yes, 38 black borders is uh, what I told QB. Well, actually, I told him like 34. Oh my goodness. Insane. Oh, dude, easy. Go back to strong snipers. <laughs> it's a long grind, dank, but it's well worth it well worth it um do we have any plans now now do we upgrade the sniper or do we get the ace these are the questions oh uh, how about this we'll make the top on a full metal jacket and leave it on strong this guy can go to first and we'll get shrapnel and bouncing bullet Yeah, RNG doesn't fare well with round 22. That's why Grandmaster strats use Pat's Roar. Oh, I see. I was unaware that that was considered a hard round because we handled it with such ease. Beautiful. Round 27. I don't see being a problem, but I could that could just me be being dense, you know? I feel like the ninja just carries. Oh. That one yellow just blowing through scared the heck out of me. 27 is the most satisfying round, dude, especially if you have a, uh, um, what are they called? A glaive ricochet? Oh, then 27 is satisfying. That's very satisfying. Oh, Trollo, you got it. Um, I'm thinking now we get the ace. Uh, just because either that or we get Grandmaster or we get an elk. Oh, I kind of like the elk idea. Oh, Kyubi with the ad time. Huge ad energy. You love to see it. I even had it up and ready. Do we go Grandmaster? Grandmaster with pickles for 40, I think is what we do. There we go. Elk's not bad. No, it is definitely not. Pickles on that ninja, kind of cracked, not gonna lie. 
This guy's on first, right? Good. Good, good, good. Yeah, I need to use pickles more. I could also give it more pierce. Sharpening stone is forever. These are fair points. Bloon Jitsu. It will become a Bloon Jitsu. What did I say? Did I say Grandmaster? If we got a Grandmaster by 40, that'd be kind of nuts. Extra Pierce with Seeking is insane. We'll probably get that after Bloon Jitsu because we have 2,700. Might as well save up the little bit of extra money. Let's just get Sharpening Stone on it now. Ooh, we have another one. <sighs> Thank you, Sax. Dude, the ninja is so good. All right, let's get it in Alchemist. We need to remember to save a pickle. Save a pickle for... Uh... Oh, oh, please pop it. Thank you. For round 40. Josh, what mode are you on? And I, can I start my reset research if you ever get stuck? Oh, I see. We are on chimps. We are on chimps on X Factor. And we're just winging it. And we have a general plan. It's called bouncing bullets into Sky Shredder. And it, it should be good enough. It's just the uh, getting... It's stuff like that, man. They just sneak through. Maybe I'll just keep it on slow-mo. Winging it because I'm getting the ace? Heck yeah. Intentional puns. Hmm. Oh, I have a horrible, horrible idea. Are you guys ready for it? If I get my village now, I can make this a two is zero zero. It no longer has pickles. Well, we can put pickles on it because they will last. Dude, welcome in Shrewd, also known as Josh. Dude, what are the odds? You would get, oh, I have 5,200 monkey money. Should I buy Geraldo or get more monkey knowledge? Um, It's really up to you. I'd probably get Geraldo. He helps in chimps. And who doesn't love chimps? He is the best hero right now. It'd be super easy to grind monkey money just by beating maps with him. Ooh, I, well, I guess we're broke. Anyway, we have pickles and sharpening stone. So, I mean, there's not much. And we stomped. I was going to say there's not much more we can get right now. But yeah, Geraldo is definitely a good buy. I, I really hope we can get by with this. I think we should be able to, right? I'm not crazy. And now we can get Bouncing Bullet. Maybe I am crazy. Second village? Heck yeah, baby. It's going to be the camo one for the Sky Shredder. It's going to become... I guess we probably don't need a MIB, but it will. All right, now we can get two Bouncing Bullets for the cheap, cheap. You know? Boom. Get Sharpening Stone on it. Keep it on first. Look how cheap this is. Holy cow. Kanto with another one. You got it. Geraldo's your uncle? Dude, you have a pretty OP uncle, not gonna lie. Holy cow. But yes, the ninja elk combo is a nice, nice crutch to have. Hopefully, do we still have pickles? We do. Is Pickles... Does Pickles affect Shrapnel? 
That might have been a horrible play. But we also need to put Sharpening Stone on you. ETN's your cousin, but you're not French. Dang, the combo. Uh, Bouncing Bullet. Once we can afford it. I mean, look how cheap it is now. Does anyone know? Does Pickles affect Bouncing Bullet and uh, the Shrapnel? I assume it at least affects the Bouncing Bullet. But if it affects all the Shrapnel too, that's busted. The only thing... Is that uh, the stun versus <clears throat> the stun versus the mobs is going to be worse? Oh wait, it doesn't have that because we don't have monkey knowledge. Yeah, so it's fine. So here's the thing: I should have put the first sniper up a lot higher for future reference. Put the first sniper way higher because I want this affected by both villages, but I don't want this guy to ever steal an AMD. You know, uh, 55 seems like it might cause issues depending on the way it comes out. We're going to get uh, an Operation Dart Storm, hopefully by then. Sada's nephew. Nice. Who knew I was in the presence of such, such, uh, people with famous relatives. Uh, hopefully we can pop this bat or this mob. Wow, imagine getting a bat already. That's basically what bosses are, though. Uh, do I even want to get it? No, I'm going to stop. Start this. Put him on centered. Why not? There we go. Um, I mean, this will be. This is so unnecessary. But there we go. Um, <clears throat> each individual Paragon Totem increases the degree by one. The more you know. I didn't know it was exactly one. All right, let's get Operation Dart Storm. Uh, and I don't know. All right, let's get this guy to a 420. What is a paragon? It's uh, so certain monkeys like the dart monkey, boomerang, ninja uh, have a sixth tier. If you get all tier fives of a monkey, all three of them, you can combine them into a paragon. That's just like way too strong. But it costs uh, hundreds of thousands of dollars, so it's fine. All right, I like how we're doing. I don't know. Slash, I don't think we can go straight to a a uh, Sky Shredder, but we're going to try. Look, we got these two for the mid game. So, hopefully. Hopefully. Yo, Venus. With the, oh, good to know. I thought it was one, my bad. No problem, man. Never apologize for asking a question. That's the one thing I learned in college and at work. It was like the people who ask the most questions are usually the smartest people because they get the most answers. Well, everyone else is too afraid to ask. I just realized, well, I guess uh, Sky Shredder doesn't even need camos. Camo popping power. No, it's good. Uh, what missiles do more damage, the Comanche Commander or Operation Dart Storm? Uh, if you want a random guess, I would say the uh, the ODS, but I do not know. That's a random guess, and I would have to Google it or test it. Both of which are not possible right now. I mean, we could Google it, but we're in the middle of a chimps game. We're handling fortified mobs pretty well. By pretty well, I mean very well. Not afraid to ask a question, but afraid to be on the most wand list. You know, fair enough. 
kind of want to upgrade this guy solely because he's stealing AMDs. At least he's not stealing, uh, what's it called? Stronger stims. And we don't have any primary monkeys to make this primary training. Once we get glues, though, he will be. They're both on first, right? Okay, good. Yeah, if round 80 comes before we get this guy shorter, we get a maim. I'm honestly just gonna... That is so funny. I was in the middle of saying I'm gonna leave it on fast because I don't think we'll leak. You aren't using a guide? Yeah, I because I think we got it, to be honest. Hmm, it's already nine. All right, last try, unless we lose soon. Beautiful. He makes guides. Well, we did follow him one day. We did follow a guide. I thought it would be more entertaining, but we're okay just struggling. All right, this guy has to go up here. I wasn't sure if it'd be more uh, entertaining to watch with a guide or to struggle through. So we just tested it out. According to the wiki, ODS muscles do 18 and 4 pierce. Well, Comanche do 3 and F30. Oh, well, there you go. Comanches do more to groups, but ODS does more single target. Uh, hope you can clear it this attempt because I have to go uh, to sleep. Good night. All right. Thanks, Dank. Have a good one, my man. Unless you're saying you're going to bed after this one, in which case it's just an early, early good night. All right, we got this. Uh, why did you grow your beard out? Um, you know, I'm still not the biggest fan of having facial hair, but my dad convinced me to grow it out for a year with him. But me and him, we're growing it out for a year. It's called a yeard, and we're taking a picture every day. At the end, we'll have a cool collage. Just a cool thing to do. I thought. I figured in like 20 years, there's no way I'll look back and be like, dang, I really wish I did not grow up my beard with my dad, but that I could see it in like 20, 30 years being like, that would have been cool if I did, you know? And who knows? Maybe I'll like having a beard. It's coming in really thick. Which is, I mean, it is what I expected because I have to shave. I had to like trim it every day, but uh, so that was never an issue. I was just not really liking it. You think the year looks good? Well, thanks, man. Thanks. Imagine having a dad, dude. It's nice. I must admit it is nice. Did we get full metal jacket first? No, we went straight for the ninja and then we got Caltrops early. We got ninja discipline and then a year and then a, <laughs> I almost said a year. But then seeking and then we got uh caltrops there we go that's dark humor right there dude i freaking love dark humor dark humor is like food you know not everyone gets it all right let's get ninja discipline and then and then hope we can micro the snipers nice i'm back to strong the yard is cool though thanks man what type man, what type of maintenance are you doing for my for my beard almost none i shaved uh, right here because it was growing like on my cheekbone and then I had a neck beard going and I trimmed that I need to trim it again I don't really know what the rules are on a yard like if I'm allowed to shape it you know because I don't want it to be like disgusting caveman-y you know I still want to be able to go in public and have people think that I'm I am not homeless um personal preference I suppose uh, put you to first tell you pop it and put you back to strong um so i mean i won't just like be letting it grow free i'll shape it a little how many black borders do you have 
uh we have all the beginners all the intermediates and then this is the last advanced and then we have two experts so however many that is i don't know the actual number there we go put you back on strong here's a hot take sushi is popular but still underrated i don't feel like that's too hot i feel like a lot of people would agree with you there i like i've said before i've only had sushi i think once and i don't think it was good sushi it was just like bought from a whole foods which means it can't be good sushi it was just like average and i would say it was average and it's not that i don't like i love seafood it's just i have never really had the opportunity one farm away from a gold border nice Oh, 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 do I have to do anything? Maybe that was a question. I missed it. Uh, for round 22, you can get Geraldo spikes to compensate for RNG. It's probably a good idea. I'll, ha I'll have his shop open. We could also get pickles or sharpening stone. I like the pickles idea, not gonna lie. If we have pickles, because that also... I assume gets applied to uh, his caltrops. So let's, uh, once I assume the round is over, yeah. And then we won't get sharpening stone yet. For some reason you love shrimp sushi, but nothing else. Hmm, shrimp, I love shrimp, so shrimp sushi probably smacks. Uh, let's see. I never realized how greedy I am until seeing myself do impoppable with perma spike, Bez, Elite Sniper, and Druid of Wrath. <laughs> That's funny. That's funny. Yeah, dude. Greeting on impoppable is a good time because you can just get everything you've ever wanted to and more. There we go. This ninja is a beast now. What does a gold border mean? It's if you, like, in the middle of a chimps run, you exit to home and then go back in. Then instead of getting a black border, you get a, uh, a gold border. Have I ever had paella? Is that paella? Paella? No, I have not. No. I don't even know what that is. Yo, what's up, CM? Welcome in. There we go. There's a sushi place around me that has the best shrimp rolls. Nice. I am happy for you. Did we get... What did we get last time? I feel like we got best shooting and shrapnel, but I kind of just want to get an alchemist. Not going to lie. Kind of just want to go like this. Wait, so black is better than gold? Yes, sir. Yeah, think of it like an onyx, onyx border. Does pausing in chimps affect the black border? No, it's just exiting out of the game, uh, exiting to home. I believe it's called blacking out. Cause like in the middle of a round, you can just restart the round by exiting to home and loading back in. So you can, uh, you can cheat a loss and the game recognizes that and gives you a gold border, even if it was on accident. Because I accidentally got one before I knew that a gold border was a thing just because I closed my game on mobile. Like we got to like my grandma's house for Christmas or something. I just pause it. We got two villages and zeros. Okay. Yeah, I yeah, we're definitely doing this in a different order, but that's okay. I like this order better because <laughs> we're going to save a little bit of money and we're going to get our balloon jitsu up. Uh, unless we lose, then I will like this order worse. <laughs> but we'll probably be fine. Famous last words, but we'll probably be fine. If we lose, then we're just going to jump into the Kahoot. Do, 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 do. Dude, what a banger, this song. Oh, guys, I have horrible news, I, like genuinely horrible news about the tournament. Just today, Tootie backed out. He's uh, no longer able to make it. 
which is a big shame. He was the biggest guy in it, but I did expect a few people to back out, which is why uh, we've had this plan since like January. And I waited to post it for so long because I was like, it's close enough. No one's backing out. And, <laughs> and then we posted it and like a day later he backed out. I was like, oh, dang it. Oh, well, it happens. I get it. I the one thing I'm not looking forward to is having to explain that 27 different times on the stream but that's okay kind of rude nah stuff comes up stuff definitely comes up I mean it's definitely hard to commit to stuff like pretty far in advance I mean even to me um do we start yeah we should get a, a two zero zero even to me this year i committed to going somewhere with my family um in january as well and then i just found out the dates of a vacation that my girlfriend's family is going on uh and they were on the same day so i had to back out of one because my girlfriend's fa Ooh, family like paid for the plane tickets already um before I let them know that I already paid for the Airbnb of my family's one. So I had to back out. So like stuff like is just unexpected and comes up. You can't perfectly plan. Can you undo the gold border? Yeah, you just have to be chimps again. All right, let's get monkey business, monkey commerce. Uh, We need to get pickles as well. All right, we have enough money. Hopefully we can just beat this without pickles. Looks like we will. Imagine having a significant other. I know it's just, it's so much work, you know? Let's get you pickles on you. Do we want sharpening stone or anything? That seems wasteful. Uh, we'll just have this open in case we need the trap, though I would be blown away if we do. We'll see though. With the pickles bloom jitsu that's this time buffed by an alchemist, I think we'll be okay. Yeah. Jerry's fire. Do we have that? That would spank. Boom. All right, we'll put it on fast forward. Because if we don't beat these rounds, we weren't winning anyway. Let's be honest. Does your girlfriend give you hints that you can't understand? Guys, I will give you the biggest tip you have ever heard. This is this is 500 IQ H bomb slash Smack Daddy Josh tips that you guys have to follow. Okay. The biggest thing you can do in a relationship as a guy from day one, purposely ignore every tip, every every single hint. That way, when they do want something. They give you hints that are so heavy handed that you can't miss them. It is the easiest thing ever. And you can then still miss them on purpose if you want it to get even easier. It's free. And I'm okay if Nat heard that because we're far enough in the relationship now that uh, I'm just going to keep doing it. Yeah, big brain. It only gets easier, folks, as the time goes on. Yeah. Because, all right, think about it. Ready? If you pick up on them, like, every time, the hints are going to get slightly less and less. And then when you miss them, they'll be so mad. They'll be like, how did you not pick up on that? Because they expect you to get it every time. But if they expect you to never get it and you get one, oh, my goodness. You made their year. Oh, ad time by ice cream. You got it. My man, the best thing about ad time is that anyone coming into the stream doesn't get ads for the next 21 minutes. Hence, we have a timer on the ad time uh, redemption. You'll love to see it. Let's see. Yeah, we're fine. We'll just keep rolling. We'll go straight to a bouncing bullet. 
Oh my goodness, they got so far. Is this guy on first? No, that's why. Gold border is better than black border? Get out of here. You're silly. You're silly and wrong. Black border gets the cool shininess that goes around, the glint. There we go. The black is sleek, yes. The gold looks very similar to the wood and it doesn't have the shininess that goes around. The black is clearly better, just objectively. And if you disagree, your opinion is wrong. Three ads, that's a big rip. Why don't you should get, if you watch uh, people on Twitch other than just me uh, and you subscribe to like anyone, you should just get Discord Nitro because then you get no ads on every channel. It's better than subscribing, 100%. It's way better. Discord Nitro Gang for life. All right, we're close to the second bouncing bullet and then we can get another alchemist. Oh, we also need stronger stim. You have Nitro and didn't know that? Yeah, I mean, unless they've changed something. Nitro's the bomb. Let's see, we'll get stronger stim. Stronger Sim seems easy and free, but so does this alchemist. And he also looks more fun. There we go. How do you think they should nerf Geraldo? His mechanics are very complex. Oh, the easiest one is nerf his experience gain. Nitro is the H bomb, perhaps? Hmm, very punny. I confirm it is the H bomb. Uh, but yeah, they at least have to nerf his experience gain. Um, they already nerfed sharpening stone on bouncing bullet. It used to be even better. So that was a good one. Uh, what else? I mean, some of the stuff is so good. Like pickles is so cheap and so good. Sharpening stone probably shouldn't last forever. Um, I don't really use the idol, so I can't really talk on it. The nails can stay, I guess. They're super good. The, everything about him is so good. I don't know if they just do price nerfs. That's like the easiest way, but that's the most boring way to nerf him. Uh, we have six grand. Was it camos last time that leaked? No, it was just normals. It was just normals. Uh, let's get an ODS. Honestly, though, his base price, XP gain, item prices, item utility, <laughs> and strength. Yeah, they're going to have to nerf him into the ground and he'll still be okay. Which uh, we should probably take advantage of that while we can. Because uh, it's kind of like Brickle. Brickle was just free wins when she came out. And then they nerfed her to being bad. They have to keep up. Geraldo being the best for a while so everyone buys him and once most of the people have spent their monkey money on him then they can nerf him so we probably have a little bit left it's coming with the next balance change for sure uh this one has jungle drums right all right we'll just lock up the camera detection we don't really need it for a while uh Oh my goodness, yo, Hot Shot Co. Thank you for the sub, my man. I appreciate you. Enjoy that emo to no ads. Oh man, coming out of nowhere with the with the the freaking or subscription. There we go. I finally thought of the word. Thank you. Appreciate you. They can't touch the NFT though, because nothing gets past his bow. <laughs> yeah, that Quincy NFT. That thing. That thing's the bomb. Honestly. I was going to say I'd be okay with him not touching it, but he he keeps up with Ben in farming. So in boss events, not quite to the same extent, but like pretty close. And then you also get his utility. Oh, a Hydra, you got it. Thanks, Kanto. A hold, I get him. If you're talking about Geraldo, then heck yeah. You love the emotes? Well, thank you. We have a, 
some better TV ones, TTV ones, but I'm not gonna lie, kind of forgot what they were, what they're called. I know we have GGGG, which just spits out a GG. <laughs> Why is your monkey ace goose? It's from Top Gun. Oh, one more G. I wanted it to just be GG, but you have to make it at least four characters. It's this. Oh, that's F. Whoops. Boom. And it spits out that emote. If you have better TTV installed, you'll see a special GG. All right, we have 12 grand. Last time we lost. So are you ready for this? We're going to get supply drop. We lost on 64. So I'm actually going to get an elite sniper. Much cooler. Top Gun is such a good movie. I'm not going to lie. I don't think I've seen it all the way through. I've seen it many times on TV to the point where I've probably seen it all, but I have not seen it just in one sitting all the way through, which I'm kind of disappointed in myself. Maybe this weekend I'll watch it from start to finish. You have more water bottles than darts that come out of the ODS. Oh, easily. Right now I only have one. Oh, I actually have two. I have another one that's empty, um, but I'm washing them all. You guys get it. Oh, yes, we have to get. Oh, first of all, we have bunnies. Not camo. Ew, gross. Pickles. Do I want the bunnies or do I want the elite sniper first? Probably elite sniper. Got to use that ability. I don't know if we need a second supply drop. Because we got spanked by this round last time. Oh, I guess the uh, double pure shrapnel does wonders. Those got really far. I should not have sped that up. Wizard and Dartling is the best two TC. Oh, 100%. 100%. The Ray of Doom, Prince of Darkness is free. They ner And it has been that way. They nerfed the Prince of Darkness's price. Doesn't matter because they made the Ray of Doom better. <laughs> so it just got, it's like just as easy, if not easier. What about Quincy anti balloon? Too much work. How many abilities do you have to use? If it's more than zero, it's too much work. All right, we're getting really close. We need 1,000 more dollars. This is gonna be exciting when we beat it. Is this the last advanced map that we need? Oh, I guess we still have to beat half cash, but half cash is easy, right boys? We're so close. We're so close boom uh you're going on first but now our other one shoots even faster and then our main mob is going to shoot so fast what about geraldo one tc does it not work anymore feels bad thanks for half cash facts uh all right now we're going for sky shredder i lied because there's no way we get to sky shredder by 80. Guys, I am just bamboozling you right now. You guys thought I was going for Scratch Shredder like four times already. You have cash on this map is interesting. Yeah, it's going to be brutal. Dang, Tibbers, you're kind of cracked. Yep, time to get deadly precision. And then we're not going to get Sky Shredder till like the 90s. But that's okay. Just put on double cash. True. We'll use powers and instas and double cash. The one thing about half cash that I don't like is that if you use an insta monkey, it's just like a guaranteed win because you're only going to 80. Especially if you use an because either an insta lets you get a farm and make it normal, or you can use an insta farm. Yo, thanks, MF. You're a big fan. Well, I'm glad I could help you out. Woo, pay to win. Heck yeah, baby. At least I'm a big fan that chimps, you like can't pay to win. I have down a zero tower unpoppable with just super monkey storms. That's funny. That would be epic. Mame. There we go. All right, we should be good. We should be good. Next up, 
we have the infamous sky shredder and then we'll have to get camo detection on it we could get camo detection now but i'd rather just get the sky shredder earlier dang that was a quick round 76 i think we got this am i saying that way too early 100 but i think we got this boys supply drop plus zero dollars dude it's the bomb it's free i just remember the time i drowned balloon areas with cash drops best 350,000 monkey money spent yeah i guess that would be an easy win huh that would probably get you the dub if you started with 350k pickles we can do pick oh and bunny what am i doing bunny is well worth it we can also get a genie i'm okay delaying it for the bunny even though the bunny i mean the bunny would be super helpful for 80. am i playing on chimps yeah yes we are we're trying to get the black border on this bad boy shouldn't be too hard the one nice thing about all the expert maps is that i have not black bordered is I have done videos on good starts, like uh, the sub dart and the triple dart monkey and the dart sniper. And I have, uh, like I've done the starts for like Ravine and Sanctuary and ouch. I've done them before. So I think they won't be the worst things we've ever done. It'll definitely be a grind though. Uh, oh, 350k monkey money worth of cash drops. Easy. Yo, welcome back, Frank. You actually might have been back for a while. I just haven't been reading names. Uh, out of all the tier fives, what do you want to be buffed, nerfed the most? Um, Before this patch, it was probably the Prince of Darkness. It's been the best. It's been so good for so long. I'd be okay with the uh, Sky Shredder being nerfed just because it's been the bomb for a while. And buffed, dude, my boy, the Bloon Solver needs his buff. Great question. My personal opinion, Dark Castle is easier than X Factor. Oh, I agree. I've black bordered Dark Castle. Dark Castle was free in comparison one to ten honestly how much do you know about balloons like a eh, like a seven it depends on the day live i know a lot less because i'm just thinking about so many things trying not to have this whole place melt down but uh not live much more should have expected that from one of your videos law <laughs> Yeah, we love the glue around here. The most balanced thing is that Geraldo sells is the nails. And the nails are freaking good, too. Oh, no. Yeah, we're fine. I'm sure of it. Ooh! Super ceramics are getting far, boys. Uh, You should try doing streams on Twitch. Do you mean streaming on youtube we're gonna have the big stream on youtube honestly i would grow way faster if i did just use ace micro you know at one point i did know ace micro but i completely forgot it i learned it for um <laughs> what map it was kind of a joke oh i learned it for geared we were microing on geared They're basically road spikes if they weren't power. Dude, it's just road spikes from balloons in the early days. Balloons 4. Maybe we'll just get a genie to get by. Genie OP. Also, we'll get double pickle. And we still lost. Dang. 84, 10 grand away. So we actually weren't even close how much do the bunnies cost 
1600 we had three bunnies look if i bought the bunnies earlier to where we could get all four we're probably okay we just need bunnies dude bunnies are the way to go nat you can't hear her in the other room is saying why didn't you get the bunnies well boys that's gonna do it for balloons but if you didn't know we end every wednesday stream with a kahoot where you get a free to enter uh chance to win a free sub all you have to do is type in the pin and win a quick trivia game of a random topic today's mm, i always want to say it but then it makes it super easy for people to cheat There we go. It's got to be. This one, this one looks glorious. I just have to vet it quick. Ooh. All right, this one's easy. You guys, you guys will know this one. All right. Classic mode. Bring it over here. Hope you guys are ready. If you guys want to join our game of Kahoot and a good chance at winning a free subscription to the channel, go to www.kahoot.it and enter pin 1999834. What we are going to do. Oh, I had one thing to do. Oh yeah, we have to change the title to Kahoot. Four subs. And then go over to just chatting. There we go. Not Kanto is in. Now I'll just take a few bites of my salad and make a mess. I still don't know how to eat with my mustache, dude. I get it all over. Hmm. I have to make sure it's set up quick. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. We don't want autoplay. We want randomized order of questions. Do we want like a different background? No. Oh, ugh. No. We could put our logo. How do I upload my logo? Still gross. We want standard. All right, I'll give you guys like a minute to join. Yes. If someone with a sub wins, they get to choose who to give it to. Your delay is like five seconds. Don't worry, because we are uh, we are sending the questions and answers to your device. So even if my stream is delayed, you can rate it on your device in real time. So. You won't have a delay. You'll have as much delay as it takes to get to the Kahoot server, but it would be that way no matter what. <laughs> What's the Kahoot about? Tibbers, if you win this one, I will always, from here on out, make my own Kahoot and do it private. Because you've won every single public Kahoot and you've lost every single mental, or every single private Kahoot. So I'm on to you. I will make every single one private if you win this one. You choked? Convenient that you choked on the exact two that uh, were uh, private. Dude, smelly otters. Just realized that 69 is divisible by 69. Nice. Um, link fan, you go to www.kahoot.it and then you enter that pin up top. I'll give you like uh, 15 sec. I'll give you until I solve the Rubik's Cube. The pin is 199-9834. How about this? We'll solve the Rubik's Cube, and once we do that, uh, we'll go. Sound like a plan? Oh, I'm choking already on the Rubik's Cube, so you guys have plenty of time. I forgot how to solve this thing. Hopefully, you guys can kind of see what I'm doing. 
Josh stream says you're playing. Did I never hit done? Oh, it didn't update. It's just chatting. There we go. All right. I lied. We're going to start mainly because I don't think anyone else is joining. So I'll just finish the whites and we'll hit start. I don't want to keep you guys waiting and wasting your precious time. I'm also absolutely throwing this uh, thing. I put it in the wrong spot twice already. Anyway, I got the whites done and that's all that matters. 17 people. All right, let's send it. I somewhat vetted this one, so it's not my fault if the answers are wrong. This one is about Pirates of the Caribbean. Question number one. What is the name of the first movie in the Pirates of the Caribbean series? Is it Jack Sparrow, The Curse of the Black Pearl, Dead Man's Chest, or The Black Pearl? You guys got this. This is iconic. Where I live, we've had intense winds. Keeps blowing my long hair into my face. Brutal. It is the curse of the black pearl. Yes. Big batch. Answer and quick. From whom did Jack Sparrow get his magic compass? Did he found, find it on a trip at Calypso? Stole that compass from a pirate? He once struck in battle or local merchants. It is Calypso. It was the, uh, the lady with the dreads that turned out to be a goddess. If I remember correctly. You don't remember the movies? I haven't seen them in a long time, but they're so good. At least the first one is. Who became the king of the pirates? Is it Hector Barbosa, Jack Sparrow, William Turner, or Elizabeth Swan? I'll give you a hint. It's a she. It is Elizabeth Swan. Elizabeth Swan. Dude, that timer was so fast. Holy cow. That was crazy. Yeah, because Jack Sparrow voted for her, didn't he? I believe that's what happened. What was William's father's nickname? Was it Otter, Slap, Sticky, or Growth? I don't know this one. I'm gonna go with Otter. <laughs> I don't think it's Otter. I'm going with I'm going with Slap. Slap is my official guess. Oh, let's go! Huge. I mean, my time would have been horrible, but there we go. You have no idea what they are. Okay, just click along, baby. Just click along. What was the name of Davy Jones' former love? Harista, Calypso, Nobody, or Fistia? It's got to be Calypso, right? These timers are so fast. Frank Henderson's seen the movies, dude. Frank knows his Caribbean. How many silvers did Henry Coach give to Jack Sparrow's team to save their captain? Oh, clearly 10 silver. Dang it. Five? Nico is Nico always gets it right when everyone else gets it wrong. He's like the opposite. What was the name of William Turner's son and Elizabeth Swan? Is it Hector Turner, Henry Turner, William Turner, or Marco? It's got to be Henry. That's the only one that makes sense. Let's go. Apparently, I'm, I know more about Pirates of the Caribbean than I thought. How did the son of Julian Turner, probably Julian, uh, and Elizabeth Swan save his father from the curse? He sacrificed himself instead of his father. He blew up his father's ship. He found the trident to preside and broke it and lifted the curse, or he took the heart and returned it to his father's body. Oh, it's got to be red. Is it really Julian with an M? No way, right? It has to be a typo. You're choosing C from now on? Is that the new movie? I have, I guess I haven't seen that. I've never seen the Trident of Poseidon. That must be the new one. Nico, freaking comeback of the century. All right, question nine of 11. Does Captain Barbosa die forever or does he come back to life? 50 50 shot. You guys got this. Yo, what's up, cold ramen? Cold ramen? What in the world? Are you eating it by the brick, like out of the pantry or like leftovers from the fridge? I guess the pantry would be room temperature. It is. He does come back to life. All right. I. Oh, two questions left, dude. Frank. Frank could throw. Who plays Captain Jack Sparrow? 
Is it uh, George Clooney, Tom Hanks, or Meryl Streep? <laughs> Dude, full faith, Frank was one of the two. Dang. All right, let's go. In what movie do William Turner and Elizabeth Swan get married in? 10 second timer. It's it's three, by the way. You guys got this. GG's, GG's. Let's see who won. And third place, we have Sax Band Kid. Dude, I also played the saxophone back in band. Not Kanto in second. Well done. And in first with 8079, Frank Henderson, the Chad of uh of Pirates Knowledge. Yo, Frank, can you type quick to gift you the sub? Oh, let's go. Well, well timed. Well timed. GG's all around. Frank, your subscription is in the mail. Well, boys, that is going to do it for today's stream. We got to around 84 on chimps. So we'll take that down uh, probably Saturday, assuming we beat uh, the boss. But um, yeah, that'll do it for now. Nine out of 11. Dude, you'll love to see it. Well done. All right, boys, I'll be live again Saturday at 8 a.m. We'll take down the boss. We'll try to take down X Factor Chimps and we'll have a good time doing it. But it was a pleasure and I'll see you all then. Bye, everyone. Bye. Cold ramen. I'm sorry you got such a short time in here.